That's a happy camper right there. Package secured, let's go home, put them in the tank. What is going on guys? Today is a beautiful day in South Florida. It's getting a little chilly if you guys saw our last video. That's why we put our pond fish into a new pool pond inside in the warmth so they're not going to get cold and they're going to survive. So if you haven't seen that video, go check it out. But in today's video, we were actually going to be doing, doing something super awesome. We're going to be getting some more stuff for the 20 gallon tall to go in with our female beta sorority tank. By the way guys, if you are new here to the channel, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button because if you don't know already, at 15,000 subscribers, we're going to be building the most awesome tank room you will ever see. We're going to have every species in the world. It's going to be... It's mind-blowing how awesome it's going to be. So remember to hit that subscribe button and turn those post notification bells on so you never miss a video. And if you are a subscriber already, drop a like, drop a comment. Let us know what's up. Let us know how you're doing. Let us know what you think about our new tanks. And uh, share this video to everyone so that they can subscribe as well and we can get to 15,000. We're halfway there, guys. We are halfway there. So we want to get there as soon as possible. Let's just keep it going. Keep the train moving, all right? But yeah, we're going to be getting some new fish for this 20 gallon haul to go along with our beta fish that are they're just doing awesome in there. By the way guys, I a lot of you guys have been DMing me on Instagram. I love it. I love the talks. Um, you, you guys send me your fish. You guys got some great fish. Sometimes you guys inspire us uh, some ideas that we could do. We're taking all ideas in, into consideration. And anyways guys, let's get into the video and let's go get some of these awesome neon crazy looking fish. Let's do it. All right Jimbo, where you at buddy? There he is. Jims. There he is, the no eyed fish, the tradition. And by the way guys, a lot of you guys want us to buy him, but he sadly is not for sale, but he's living a good life in here with all his buddies, so. What we are here for today are these neon tetras right here. There's three in here, and there's two in here. These are gonna be going to the beta sorority tank because you guys have suggested to get uh, neon tetras, and there's one in there. So yeah, they're gonna be really cool watching them dart around, and yeah, but really quick, I don't know what these are, but there are so many of these things and they all just sit there together just swimming it's really cool this tarpon this endo pacific tarpon has been here for a couple like probably about a month he's 50 bucks i think he's just calling our name to be honest with you let us know if you guys want us to get this guy i mean it's what we have in the pond if you guys didn't didn't know we have the, we have the obviously bigger version of this but that is the baby and i think he's calling our name so uh, drop a comment below, should we get this guy? I don't know, we're thinking about it, because no one's buying him. We have a perfect home for you. Let us know. Look at this guy. That's a happy camper right there, are you kidding me? He's just smiling all day. <laughs> I love him. But anyways guys, let's get these Tetras. We're gonna grab these guys, and we'll see you guys back at the crib. We got our fish, and uh, instead of securing it with the seatbelt, you know, we just got this little fish box. That's it, put him in the fish box. Perfect fit. Package secured, let's go home, put them in the tank. We have made it back to the house. We are gonna start acclimating these neon tetras, and I think one was like a, a red, red something tetra, so this tank's really coming along. It's so cool, the five, everyone wants to eat right now. All they do is wanna eat. As soon as you walk up to the tank, they just wanna eat. It's the funniest thing, but we got five betas in here and two guppies. We're about to add five new tetras, so I'm gonna acclimate these things for 20 minutes. Then we'll get back to you guys when we're going to put them in the new tank. Alright guys, I'd have to say, this tank is coming together pretty nice. Look how friendly it looks already, baby. We are happy. We are happy about it. We are very happy about it. We already They've been acclimating for like, like 25 minutes probably. Yeah, about 30 minutes. So they're probably pretty much perfect. We got five of these guys. Three in there. Three two big, there. two little babies. We'll put the babies in first. First things first, wet your hand. Yeah, absolutely wet your hand, guys. Everyone comments. Why are you using your hands? It's safer. They don't get caught in the net. Our net isn't is it's pretty big, so they won't get caught in the net and right, ready? the hands will not take their slime coat off. So here's our first batch of small guys. Here's our first one. There he goes, buddy. He's looking fresh. I love him already. Oh look at all the baits going to check him like, out. What the heck? They're all going to check him out. Like what all the right, heck is dirty. that? It's hilarious. Alright, let's get the other guy. Here comes dirty two. Dirty two. There's dirty two guys. He's cheesing. The beta's shot down to go check them all out at first. It was pretty funny. So, uh, also guys, I, I was thinking about getting like a little piece of driftwood in the back. Because I think it would make the, all the uh, plants pop a little bit. So, I think I saw a little one at um, the store we go to. So, I'm probably going to put one in the back there. I think it would look really nice. And she would appreciate it. And so would she. And she, and she, and she. 
All right, next we'll get the put big boys in there. Three more. You the tell the difference nice. between the red, the, the ones, yeah, see how those ones are only half their bodies are red and the other half's kind of clear? These ones, their whole body is red yep. on the bottom. So I forget which is which. One of them. I think Robin said these are the cardinal, something like cardinal. Yeah, something, something. Like but, um, something, 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 something. Hey, they're the bigger ones, so we're getting those in now. Hey, dirty three. The betas love them. What? I, I love the betas, dude. Yeah, this God. is such a cool tank. Yeah, this is honestly, honestly my favorite tank so far. I've never had like a this style community tank. It's like actually really awesome to look at. Swim down to the buddy with your friends, man. <laughs> <clears throat> they look great in here, dude. Look at them all in the corner. That is sick. All right, got another dirty. The last one? Okay. The last dirty. Dude, I love these guys. They might be my favorite. They might be my favorite. Look at them all in there. They're all behind the plants. Look at them all chilling. Guys, comment down below what you think about this tank so far. I think it's really coming along really nice. They look really dope in here, actually. Okay. Look at them back there. It's just so much color darting around. Yeah, thing, you know? yeah, it looks great. Let's see if they want to grub. Mm, I love it. Let wanna... us know what you guys think down in the comments and subscribe. We've got bigger tanks coming with bigger things. Remember, 15,000 subscribers. You're not going to miss it. It's gonna be, it's gonna be mind, mind blowing. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Give them a little food, a little bit. A little footage. Dude, the tattoos all over. We switched like... them to the pellets because uh, the guppies like them, or flakes. the flakes because the guppies like them. But, the um, so in with the... the betas will really eat both pe uh, pellets yeah, they and flakes. Care. They could care less. Oh yeah, smack it! Boom! So cool. How many betas are in here? Oh yeah, five in here. Yeah, five betas in here. That one's purple. Yeah, five that tetras. Purple. Yeah, purple. So nerves. awesome. Love that. Two guppies, five tetch, rice. These guys are freaking sick in the back. And let us uh, know, guys, what else we can put in here that'll be friendly with everything. Shrimp. Really coming along. All right, you guys, uh, if you guys have not seen our last video, uh, that video is, well, you should just go check it out for one, but um, we took our fish out of our pond because we had a cold front. The cold front came through last night and it got into like 62, so I'm really happy that we ended up doing it and we didn't like risk it. So let's go over um, to see how they're doing. And you guys, let us know if you guys want to see more pond videos because we want to be start building more ponds, maybe like a mini pond or a bigger pond for those fish to go into in the future, but that'll probably be like in 2019. But the mini pond, that's anytime you guys want it. So if you guys really stress it down in the comments, we'll do it. So let's go over and check out the fish in the pool pond. Here is the pool pond that all our fish are in right now. Everyone is quite happy in here. We got the nice little flow right here. Everyone's tending to just stay in the flow, but the gar, the tarpon, the three sharks, one, two, three. Shark one, two, brothers. three, yep, the three shark brothers. Jeremy's looking freaking mighty fine today. And uh, the Paku's sitting somewhere under here. There he is, right there. So everyone's living, everyone's living well in here, and uh, they'll probably be going back in the pond shortly because that blanket is actually doing a very good job of keeping that uh, pond warm, so. All right, you guys, that is gonna be the end of the video. The fish are good in the pool pond. I'm really happy we took him out because the cold front did come through last night and it was actually very cold. So um, I feel a lot better that we did that and put him through that stress. I think it was actually worth it because being out there in the cold water and the cold air, it's just it, it's just not healthy for these fish. Um, let us know if you guys want to see more pond videos or do you guys want to see more tank videos. If you want to kind of get a feel for what you guys want to see. Um, yeah, the neon touchers are actually sick in the new tank. It's really cool to see all those colors darting around in the, in the tanks. I think that's going to be it for this video. And one, one quick thing, at 15,000 subscribers, we are going to be doing an awesome tank room. So go down and subscribe. I can't stress it enough to get to 15K. It's going to be absolutely sick. So um, drop a like, comment, just help us out. All right, we'll be seeing you guys tomorrow. Peace.